Hello guys, I'm Getty Speaks and I'm back here today with new trailer reactions for you. Now the movies I'm going to be doing a reaction to are not new movies really. There are some that are old, there are some that are not too old, and there are some that just, you know, came out a year or two. And I don't know if you want to call that old or not. Anyway guys, like you guys know, I always tell you about how much I've been watching indie movies since I was a young girl. And um, as much as I love to say that I've watched so many indie movies, there are some that I haven't actually watched. Um, like I told you guys in my introduction um, um, video, I just started getting back into Indian movies um, some years ago. And so when I started getting back into them, I was only watching people like Shah Rukh Khan, Amir Khan, and um, of course Salman Khan. But later on, I realized there were more actors that were doing really good movies like Akshay Kumar, Ritik Krishan, Ajay Dev Khan, um, and the new ones right now like Robert Kapoor. Um, reversing. So basically, I've done a lot of trailer reactions on my channel, but I've not done some movies, um, some trailer reactions for some movies. There are some really good movies actually from those stores I was just mentioned right now. So I'm gonna go ahead and start doing some of them right now. And um, as you guys know, for my Bollywood movie reactions, many of them I cannot really show you the whole trailer because we're gonna get a block, a copyright um, block from this um, production companies. But I'm definitely gonna try to show you as much as possible. And then we'll have a full discussion about this later on. So we're going to start right now today with Padmavati, starring Ravia Singh and Deepika Padukone, as well as um, Shahid, Shahid Kapoor. And um, hopefully we have much to talk about. And this is also being directed by Sanjay, Sanjay Lee Basali, who's one of my favorite Indian act, um, directors actually. So let's go ahead and watch this trailer. And um, I, like I said, I know many of you watched it. This is my first time watching the trailer. So I'm just going to try to watch it and enjoy it. And then we'll have a full discussion about this later on. So here is a trailer for Padmavati. Okay, so that was Pamavati, Starian Ravier Singh, Shahi Kapoor, and of course the one and only Deepika Padukone. 
down. This movie, of course, came out last year, and um, I didn't get a chance to see it. Nor did I even get a chance to watch the trailer because I was not watching for um, Balu movies at that time. But of course, I love Sanjay Lila um, Basali. He's done a lot of good movies, like I said earlier, that I've watched. And this is one of those trailers where you really don't need a lot of words in order to really enjoy the beautiful, the beautiful location shots, the score, the acting, the um, cinematography, the editing. It's just beautiful to watch, really. I'm surprised a movie like this didn't actually get nominated for Best Foreign Movie in the Oscars because it was just a beautiful, beautiful thing to see. And of course, um, when I watch... Um, you know, I always tell you guys that I love Ravier Steed and I really do love him and I guess one of the reasons why I really do love him and I'm beginning to think to myself because I feel like he's a showman when he does his, when he acts. I um, mean, of the movies I've seen him in, he does, he's, he's a showman. He, um, he reminds me a lot about a young Shah Rukh Khan, um, who used to be a showman, who used to, um, be, uh, an elaborate romantic hero. I just love that about, um, Ravier Steed. Obviously, all of his movies are not going to be a showy kind of movie. A um, movie like, like, you know, when we saw the trailer for Gully Boy, it doesn't seem like he's actually showing um, that kind of showmanship in that role. Although he does show a lot of s subtleness in his um, acting. But nevertheless, um, Sherry Khan does it also. Sometimes he's a showman and sometimes he's not. And I think Raphael Singh has a lot um, of Sherry Khan in him, really. So, um, apart from that, Shai Gabba was okay, but I think Ravier Singh's character and personality in this movie outshine, outshine, oh, outshine, sorry, outshine um, Shai Kapoor. And I do love Shai Kapoor as an actor though, so I'm kind of um, a little upset for him that he's not really as showy as he can be in this role. And I would think that he's probably a lead actor in this role, but it seems like the supporting actor who was Ravier Singh actually steals the whole movie from him, really. And of course, Tavika Padukha is just a beautiful, beautiful woman to watch. She is a wonderful actress. I think she's a fantastic actress. One of the top actresses right now in Bollywood. Um, I just love watching her. She's just beautiful and um, she does um, the acting craft quite, quite well. Of course, you guys, um, if you're not into Bollywood news also, you would know that Ramya Singh and um, Deepika Padukone got married in November. Um, so they're, they're a power couple in India. But like I said, I love this trailer and I'm definitely going to want to watch this. I don't really need you guys to tell me. If I should watch it, because I'm not going to try to watch it, because I just love everything I saw in the trailer. But that's my reaction, guys. For those of you who have not watched it, or have not, or not seen this trailer, what did you think? What did you think about it? Did you like it? Did you love it like I did? Did you like um, the acting without talking? Did you love the shots, the beautiful shots, the costumes, the um, location shots, the score, like I did? Let me know your reaction and if you in comments in the, um, below the bar. Also, guys, if you want to watch more reactions on my channel, please subscribe and rate my channel. I'm your Tis Speaks, guys, and my reaction to Padmavati. Till next time, guys. Bye.